What is going on all you slothy, slimy, swerve, slutty scribers? My name is Fly- I'll be right back. I gotta get to this. Hold up. Nah, but seriously, what is going on all you swerve scribers? My name is Fly and hello! This is my introducing video here on the Swerve channel. Welcome, welcome. If you guys are seeing this on my uh, original channel, this video is also going up on Swerve, so go check that out over there. Otherwise, vice versa, go head over to my channel personally if you're a Swerve scriber. And subscribe over there. It's lit, boys, but we are on Black Ops 2 today. Bringing back the nostalgic action uh, sniping here. We're going to be hopping into a free-for-all game. But what I wanted to talk about today, guys, was the history of my name and uh, my, my, uh, my come up as a YouTuber and where I've kind of been, uh, what I've done in the community, and kind of the history of my past in gaming. So I wanted to talk about that with you guys, and I figured why not do it. Uh, kind of give my background here on the Swerve channel. And we're going to be voting Studio because that is the best map in my belief on Black Ops 2. Of course, I love Studio. If you don't love Studio, I don't know what the fuck is wrong with you. Anyways, guys, let's kick it off here. So, no way. This just happened again. Game lobby closed. All right, we're good. That's okay. I'm better than this getting disconnected. Come on. Of course, it had to be Studio 2. Would you look at that? It froze now. What is going on? Nice. I'll see you fuckers when it's back on. Give me a second. Alrighty. Third time's charm now. So back in about 2013, I would say, I uh, was playing MW2 and I joined a clan called G6. Me and my friend had started it up. If you guys uh, know Furby by chance, if you guys are a Furb scriber, uh, you guys probably know him, but me and him had a clan called G6. And um, this is kind of where my name began, Fly, as in Fly. This is kind of where it began. So we had a clan called G6, basically MW2. And, uh, you know, everybody, if you didn't play MW2, well, I'm, I feel, I kind of feel bad for you, to be honest with you. But, um, I joined, like I said, G6. So, you guys know the song G6. Fly like a G6, right? Well, fly, you know, the word fly. I just basically added a Y to that. And that is how I got fly in. I always thought that name was really dope. So, I kept it all throughout my career till this day. Anyways, back on G6. Hold up. God, you dainty fish, man. Uh, my episode song was obviously Fly Like a G6 or G6, whatever the name of that song is, but uh, that's how that came to be. And then later after that, uh, the channel got hacked, and then we joined um, a clan called C9, me and uh, Furby as well. We joined the same clan called C9, Cloud9 Gaming, which I'm sure a lot of you guys know, and I just dicked on that kid. Uh, but yeah, so we joined C9, Cloud9, and that was a really fun time, honestly. I met some really cool dudes on that team, but eventually... Um, the clan got hacked again. I don't know how, but uh, everybody kind of just gave up after it got hacked. And from there, uh, this is kind of when Black Ops 2 came out. Why do people get fun out of using shotguns, man? It says Black Ops 2. Anyways, yeah, so uh, Black Ops 2 rolled around, and uh, this is when I kind of looked into competitive. This is when I started paying attention to, uh, you know, Nate Shot and the Optic team and stuff like that. Why are you fucking me, dude? This kid has a shotgun and a PD uh, video. Is that what they call it? PDW? I can't even remember. My first event that I ever watched was UMG Dallas. In, uh, I believe that was when Farico played with Parasite and stuff. And it was like uh, Parasite, uh, Mercs, and all them. And then, you know, that's when I, I... Competitive really interested me. And I wanted to, you know, be a competitive player. Because I seen the prizes that they could take home and stuff. And how fun it was. And, uh, you know, the hype that it got when you were in the uh, area. So I wanted to be a competitive player. So I switched over to competitive... Uh, mainly in uh, Call of Duty Ghost. But yeah, I started playing competitive, and Ghost was when I really uh, became a more of a competitive player. I had a really good team for uh, Ghost. Uh, well, not, I will mention that. Um, we won a lot of GBs and stuff like that, some tournaments here and there. But uh, I always kept following the phase guys, because those were the guys that had always inspired me to trick shot. You know, back in G6, I did this. I, I trick shot it and fed because I wanted to uh, be like a phase guy, and I got sniped out of midair. But you know, those were the guys that I always looked up to and, you know, just their come up was crazy and I wanted to be like that. So I had never stopped following the phase guys. So Ghost rolled around and I tried some uh, trick shotting and stuff on there and I just didn't like it. And nothing really, you know, too big happened. Oh, wait, 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 wait. You guys are wondering why my name is Cinematics. This is where it comes into play. So I got my Xbox One, I believe, on, uh, or no, what did I get my Xbox One for? It was Advanced Warfare. I changed my name. That's why my name is that. Sit the fuck down. Hold up. 
Won't let you kill me, bitch. Oh my god. I just creamed a little bit. So yeah, 2015 uh, Advanced Warfare rolls around and I am confused as hell, man. Like, what the fuck is this boost jumping jetpack bullshit? This was when I really got pissed off with Call of Duty. You know, at the beginning of the game, I didn't really like it at all. Nobody likes Call of Duty at the beginning of a game that's brand new and has fucking jetpacks. Like, come on, really? Jetpacks, man. Like, I was not expecting this. This shit was crazy and it was not Call of Duty as I knew Call of Duty as. But Advanced Warfare rolls around and I got my Xbox One. And uh, I wanted a new name. I don't know why, I, but I uh, I thought of the name Cinematics, and I didn't want to spell it like Cinematics is normally spelled with a C. So I did uh, S I N U H M A T I C S. Creative, right? And then uh, eventually I wanted to shorten it down, so I got to Cinematics S N M T X. We got Double Standoff. We will be playing that. But yeah, Ghost was a really good game for me. Advanced Warfare. And uh, Advanced Warfare, I did enjoy eventually at the end, uh, competitively. I never really sniped on that game. And then Black Ops 3, obviously. I'm not the biggest fan of Black Ops 3 um, because I miss the whole sniping aspect. Like I said before, guys, FaZe is like my inspiration. Every guy in FaZe, I enjoy every guy in FaZe. And the most I look up to is Sensor and Rain. Like those two guys. And Temper. Temper has the chillest morals. And I, I believe that dude is literally the best dude on the team. But, you know... FaZe is uh, literally my inspiration and why I started all of this. I don't know if FaZe hadn't been a thing, I probably wouldn't be here right now. I'd probably be still playing sports because I used to play a hell of a lot of sports. But I'm here right now making this YouTube video on YouTube where people's hobbies become careers. Like that's crazy and all of this shit is just mind blowing. So I wanted to share kind of my history as a YouTuber and uh, you know gamer with you guys. And I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you guys are a Swerve subscriber and you guys are seeing this over on the Swerve channel, make sure you guys go check out my personal channel. You guys won't regret it. I upload daily over there, so it's worth it. It's worth the shit, man. It's lit over there. Go subscribe, and I hope to see you guys next weekend. It's been your boy, Fly, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out, ladies. Fresh like a breeze in the sauna. I can get whatever when I wanna. Trying to get around and be on the. Candy that's around, will it won't cook?